it's about how to find the forgetting OB11G repository password. Sometimes we may forget our repository password or you will be very new to the project or the environment. So, but uh, you need to access that RPD. So, how it possible? I mean, uh, without uh, knowing the password, we can't able to access the repository password. Repository in OB11G. So, uh, we need to find that uh, repository password. So to, uh, to find that repository password, we need to follow these five steps. Uh, for first step is uh, check you uh, all our services are up and running or not so um, we need to check that one first uh, so here i'm able to see here i'm able to access the enterprise manager it means weblogic server is up and see here all the ba services uh, all are in presentation service all are in up, up and running so uh, you, there is no issue with the services so i'm moving to second step that is uh, we need to execute uh, to find the repository password. We need to execute this wlst.cmd. Uh, so, in this directory, so I am going to change my directory in the command prompt. Just I opened uh, command prompt, and I, first of all, we need to type this one uh, cd space d colon obi home oracle common common bin. So, here I will execute this command. see I'm executing what it is showing see uh, what it is showing well it is not an organized so what happened is here first of all I need to set D colon see now it is going to that path now I am executing now it is working see the next step is enter your weblogic username and password host port number in below format so uh, after after connecting after executing this we need to connect to weblogic server with our weblogic weblogic user credentials so here i am given here connect off this is the weblogic this is the username and oracle123 is my password and look it is local host and this is my port number so uh, i'm using this to connect to my weblogic server to get the password see i'm pasting here and press enter see it is showing connecting to t3 local host uh, 7001 with user id weblogic if it is successful see it is showing and uh, successfully connected to admin server admin server that belonging to domain ba foundation domain so it is connected to admin server so now what we need to do we need uh, to get the password right so for that this is the final step uh, use the below command to get the password of your repository so this is the final steps so here what we need to mention is this is Mm, uh, list credential oracle.bi.enterprise comma repository.bi sample this is the uh, repository name here we need to give the repository name so we will execute this in command prompt see paste now i am pressing enter so see here uh, this is the password for this repository see it is showing here this is the password for particular repository for example i want to know for not for seven it's for six i want to check see for six also uh, oracle one two three uh, why because it, why it is showing because uh, i have set uh, a single password i mean oracle 123 is my oh, pass static password for all the repositories which i used in my tutorial so that's why it is showing oracle 123 so for example uh, if you give any wrong rpd like uh, 67 so see here what it is showing credentials either does not exist or cannot be listed if it is of type generic so it is showing one error General, yeah, it's not an error, uh, just it is uh, intimating you, uh, your RPD is not initialized in the web logic. See, now I am checking with 7. Now it is showing 
oracle 123 okay that's about uh, finding the forgotten ob 11g repository password uh, we will get back to you with another topic thank you